All right. That's okay. We learned something. At least we learned a little bit. We think we learned something. And also, Toaster, please remember to bring Zinc to Dosolo. You got it. Alrighty. On your mark. Get set. Go. Let's go see where we land. We, we landed pretty close to the North Pole last time. And that was okay. The North Pole is okay to land near. But get, landing next to this Eastern Gateway feels a lot better. It's more easy to navigate back to base based on your compass. Unfortunately, the game's just like, nah, you're going to be near the North Pole for, for your runs today. But we do have some wreckage on this save. We have some graphite already. So I like wreckage. I like graphite. I don't like how far the resin's out, but that's okay. We'll be able to make it work. And wait for the thing to flop up. There we go. And then we can get early. There we go. Fantastic, and now we go run out and get resin and bites. We got two of these, we'll pick these up. They add up over time, and it's always difficult to try and get, um, I just made filters, not canisters, oops. Uh, they, it's always difficult to get, um, like the first 250 bites or so, so being able to pick them up while just running around, um, might be worth your time pick up those smaller samples all right we're not going to run near the base because if we do we'll start stealing power from it and we don't want to do that we want our base to kind of have all of its attention not powering our backpack we can we can deal with that um, we just want our base to be centered on giving all of its power to the light um all of its power to the like, platforms that it needs to build basically Okay, we need at least one printer, so we'll start that. Okay, I like the clay. I like the graphite. All of those were good drops. What do we have in here? Medium storage? Yes, please. Okay, I'm not sure if filling it up with things was a great idea. I'm kind of questioning that one myself right now, but... It's okay. We're going to swap out medium printer here in a little bit. So when you drop, when you swap out the platform like here, you kind of just increase how much you can run around with. Like your storage space is a little better, a little bit, a little better managed. So that's why I'm doing it, but it may not be optimal. Kind of uncertain how that's supposed to work out. Alrighty, so we have some wonderful things cooking. We have a random light in our inventory that we can keep for a little bit. Uh, let's go see if we can start making another oxygen platform, another large platform. I said oxygen only because it's associated with resin. That was weird. I wonder why my, why my brain did that. It's really funny when I watch my VODs and when I look back at, like, me commentating whatever I'm doing, because, like, I'll just, like, my mind blanks, my eyes go wide. Like, I become unable to say words. And, like, what, what, it, I know what I'm trying to say, but there is a portion of my brain that literally can't figure it out. And it's great. So it tries. It does its best. <laughs> and it's wrong. <laughs> it's wrong all the time, wrong. All right, so we have... We need like five resin now, five, five, six compound now. So that'll be fine. I could have brought the storage platform out with me if we really wanted to collect all of it, but I'm okay with that, doing that for now. We will probably run out of oxygen before we run out of inventory space, probably. We could always um, use terrain tool extension to bring that closer too. Let's go do that because we are filling up stuff. Where is it? Here it is. Okay. We're just going to fill up this thing full of compound because we just need a bunch of compound and we're going to bring it all the way back to base. We're going to go make this filter so we can stay here a little longer.
this isn't optimal right now, but it'll save us time later when we need compound. So that's kind of what I'm just doing here, like using my time in the beginning of the beginning of the game to get resources that I need. Uh, may not be worth my time, but might be. Now we have two platforms made to make our large printer. But we can't because we're out of power in the base, but now we can. There we go. Now that needs to be turned back around a little bit. Okay, we have our third. So we have no resin to go downstairs with and, and exploring with, but that's probably fine. Probably. Okay. We'll start taking off these. That's all empty and ready to go. So now we're good to start heading downstairs and getting more research and stuff. Um, if I'm not mistaken, we have two resin here for our oxygen or our, our research platform. Our uh, smelter. So instead, what I'm going to do is see if I can get the rest of the bites by running around and finding more resin. More resin will be great. And if I don't find it, that'll be fine, I guess. Yes. Could have brought the platform out with me as I'm doing this. Um, but I'm seeing a distinct lack of resin along this direction. Hmm. That's a little concerning. I've got some good inventory stuff with me right now that I can't lose, so... Well, I guess we'll just keep on, you know, sticking to our guns and see what we can run into. Hopefully resin. I mean, worst case scenario, we're not too far away from base. Okay, we have enough bites for the smelter. So, uh, alright, that's just not a great direction to run, I suppose. <laughs> good, good to know. Mm-hmm. Oh, I noticed the um, beacon didn't, isn't working. I wonder if I need to pick up the oxygenator and place it in a second time. It seems to only work some some of the time, but I noticed it was more consistent uh, and, and functioning when you picked up and set it down. So uh, I'm, I did that once. Maybe I need to do it a second time. Okay, so I need to pick up one compound. And I need to pick up two of these. Need to research. That was a weird camera angle. Smelter. Now we are good to go. We are completely out of resin, but that's okay. Don't need that there, that's for sure. Well, might as well go down. Hopefully we can find resin. It's going to be a little bit of a risk. We could do tethers, but that requires us to unpack our oxygenator. Speaking of the oxygenator, we didn't actually do that. And I saw resin on screen for one frame. Okay, so there is the packaged item prompt that we want to see. Hopefully that's working. So if I saw resin for one frame, that might mean my camera clipped and I saw it. Okay, so we almost got a compound. Or a... Uh, aluminum here. So what I am going to do is pick up my seven aluminum and run back upstairs right away. Because this is um, too close to base to not do that errand. So we will pick up a little bit more aluminum as best we can. And seven if we can. seven now we got to run back upstairs hopefully not suffocate and start smelting this um i have no idea how we're going to make it out alive though like we're kind of in a weird position where we have no res i guess we can go back to our resin pit and see what we can find i was thinking i got all the resin there but maybe there's a little more resin in that resin pit oh please okay One, two, three. And this is almost done. We can start 
chucking this on here. We're gonna move our camera a little bit so it's easier to put the aluminum on. He says as he fails to put the aluminum on. Okay, there we go. Now it's on. Okay. So I guess we need to go back to the resin pit, hopefully finding more resin, because we are just struggling right now. I think this is my resin pit. Yeah, here we go. We can get like two out of this or something. Two will be enough. But any more and we're going to have some trouble. So let's go pick up like all the resin that we can right now, I guess. Um, hopefully it'll be enough. To kind of do a number of errands at base. I don't know, though. Like, I know one of the errands we need to perform is, um... Like, making another medium platform, so we can, like, start that now, because we have a little bit of an abundance of resin, but, like, we're... We are really tight on resin, so... Do we bring down only one or two? Let's bring down two, even though I want to bring down more. Um... Drop that one there. Okay, and now we're basically good to try and get the rest of the research bites. Uh, four quartz and three... It's all right. There's a... That was a wide mod. Huh. Imagine what would happen if we got a boost mod right now. That'd be nuts. Yo, I forgot that was there. Forgot to grab more aluminum. I'm gonna ignore it for now, but that's a bummer. Lots of things around here, though. Okay. Wow. Lots of boxes everywhere. It's one box at a time. Keep focused, and we need to get to 2,000 bytes. And we'll probably get there pretty soon. That's a compound. It's fall right. One, two. Three. Let's get this box. One, two, three. And we know we can get the aluminum box here in a hot second, but we still haven't found quartz yet, so we kind of want to uh, idle around until we find quartz here. Let me get one more resin. So yeah, like we can get the bites we need, but we won't have the quartz yet. And I think the quartz is important to get, so I'm going to idle about. Okay, that one needs power, so we can go do that one, I suppose, because we can unlock that one. Kind of trying to increase the amount of things that I've seen under here, so I can increase the odds of finding glass. We have found lots of wonderful boxes today. Okay, I don't need an aluminum. We have almost all the bites we need, so I'm just going to not collect any more. I could collect one for safety. I need four quartz, and then I can get get out of here. Weird that we got all the bites before we have all the quartz, but yeah, it happens. I'm going to quick double check that we have three swallerite, which we do. We have a carbon down here. Can't really do anything with that. No quartz in that direction, so I'm going to run over here, pick up some more resin to in increase the length of my stay. Lots of boxes down here, my goodness. The cloud parks on you and does more damage. Oh, no, okay, that's that's an old message. Yeah, we talked about Hispane, Hispine damage. Hispine. It's, 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 it's a Hispine. Did you know that? It's not called a Hispane. Even though it's kind of this noxious cloud that's quite poisonous, it's a Hispine, and I had no idea. 
I was pronouncing it wrong the whole time. So now I have to like build up an entirely new like vernacular and get used to saying it as his bine instead of his bane. So if you want to be like super like persnickety, whenever I say his bane, you can just be like, Toaster, don't you know what's called a his bine? Just like kind of like roast me alive for it. Don't need that, don't need that, and I kind of don't even need that one anymore. One, two. Yo, we almost just died. Alrighty, let's get out of here. I have a great way out. So what I might do is actually, we have one resin left, so we're not like within like super, super low HP ranges, but what I'm gonna do is basically mine up slowly from here. Well, we walked pretty far away from our base, so that's unfortunate, but what we can do with this is um, basically kind of be pretty far away from base while intentionally kind of walking back to it because we have the beacon and then we'll expose more of the terrain as we run around the world. We'll kind of learn what's on top of our planet, what where we can run to to get other resources as we run back. That sounds like a good plan to me. Having some trouble making this ramp and apparently we were down two caverns which might explain why the boxes were everywhere i'm a little surprised honestly but okay that makes a little bit of sense i didn't think i was that low but what what it's kind of how it works okay whoa hello so now we have to run through a forest we're apparently next to a gateway wait a minute how did we get here did we power the gateway before we run back probably not we ran that far away from base? Yikes. Um, okay, so the correct play is to power the gateway while we're out here. As weird as that sounds. So we're gonna go to the small generator, and then when we run back, the gateway will be powered and we can just start descending into the planet from there. I, I don't buy it. Honestly, it feels a little funky. So we're gonna drop our precious Fallery on the ground while we make three generators. We are out of power, so. We don't need to make two generators, that's cool. Okay. And... We could use another bit of resin while we're just doing all of this work. Okay. So now we're going to build this. Get this going. We are at the northern gateway, and we know where base is. Oh, didn't build that right. Didn't build that right? That's fine. Nailed it. Okay. So we should be good. Going down. So now we gotta, gotta go find the Oh, there's an ammonium deposit right here that I needed, and then there's three Svalorite hiding somewhere, somewhere over here. So I'm gonna go get the ammonium if I can, see if there's any ammonium down here. I don't think there was much, though. And then now I gotta go find- okay, I see it. Three Svalorite. One, two, three. And then I have an extra quartz. Uh, so now we need to get back and find a bunch of stuff, but we're doing this all out of order, but it's just like, oh, it's right here. We might as well do it. It's convenient, um, which is wild. Honestly, we might just not complete Silva until later. Um, that can't be right. Yeah, there's probably some way to like route in Silva later when you have a drill now that, now that I'm really puzzling about it. We could go for it. We could just be a little crazy. Just completely abandon all the practice and all the routing that we've done, like doing Silva as early as we do it to like favor doing it later. You know this mountain that we're gonna have to navigate through. So this mountain is like a minute of time loss, right? So we don't want to walk to the mountain again, um, which we don't have to. Yeah, my brain is a bit mush right now. All right, so we have all of our aluminum right here. Alrighty, let's go get the research online. I figured. 
Our backpack is now discharging, so let's start. Okay, so like now is like the best time to start going to the core of Silva in my mind. I don't really need those running, honestly. Okay, so we have a wide mod. Nice. I don't know what we'll do with that, but we have one. We have two resin, which we don't really need. And we need one. We want one generator, so we have that now. We're almost ready to go down to the center of, well, Silva. We don't have very much resin, and I would love to get more, but that's kind of been the the resource that's been hard to get to this game so i'm just going to go back to my resin pit see what i can find while in it and then kind of go down with it oh i guess we're printing the shuttle now but like we're like really in a weird spot all these splits don't make sense so yeah ignore them for now as best you can <laughs> all the numbers won't make sense we'll know how long it takes to complete the game by the time we're done unless we die then we'll never know It'll be a secret to everybody. All right, well, we have four. Four is enough. Four is the number I try to go down with, so... Let's not die by taking too much fall damage right off the gate, and then we'll be good to start heading down. Or 80. Let's go down pretty aggressively here. Can we go down even more aggressively? Yes. Here we go. I'm bound. Don't need this. Oh. The, the rocks. See, like, one little tiny hit of a rock, one tiny little stone, and suddenly, like, you just lose your entire core slide. Because it knocks you to the left or to the right. Uncontrollably. And then you lose what you were doing. Always a bummer. Good speed, though, other than that. Alrighty, so we hit this. We're gonna start suffocating here in a bit, so let's go ahead, get a little bit of space, start printing that. There's always some frame drop whenever we're printing something new like that. That's wild. It's very consistent. I don't know why. That's like a bug report, but like it's really minor. But like whenever you start printing stuff and then like you close it immediately and, you're, and then you start like mining again, there's like a, a couple dropped frames, like two or three. So uh, we're unfortunately going to be fighting our astroneer's camera. They appear to want to look backwards and I don't want them to, but there's nothing I can really do to stop them from it other than hold my cursor way far forward than I need to. I know we are in the mushroom biome because we're, we're on top of some mushrooms, but I can't quite get down into the mushroom biome. So, and I don't want to take too much fall damage, but if we slide our face into the wall, we should be able to make this work. Okay, got that one. Then we'll kind of slide down at an angle here. And... past this point... I don't know. Here we go. We'll take this. Okay, that wasn't too much damage. I was more damage than I was expecting, but we'll take it. Down we go. More more hard terrain. Can we avoid this hard terrain? Yes, we can. We can go over this side. Awesome. Going going fast for a little longer. And, uh, yo, camera, what are you doing? What is my astroneer wanting to do? They're like snowboarding sideways. I was giving none of those inputs. There must have been like a weird like helical like bit of dirt that they was then like kind of making them rotate in a circle and then based on how I was holding my terrain tool, it was building the helical like ramp as they were sliding sideways. Weird. All right, well, we have good first cavern here. We don't get to save much time, but we save a little bit of time. So now we're on our way to second cavern. And this should be second to last cavern where we will find more laterite that we cannot use, so we will we will drop it on the ground at some point. We're not hitting as much yellow dirt yet, so that's that's good. There it is. Just have to speak of its name and it, show, and it, and it arrives. I'd say you could risk a narrow mod. Narrow mod won't be useful in any situation. Narrow mod just inhibits everything that you want to do. Wide mod would make more sense, and boost mod would make more sense, right? What, is, what does the narrow mod do for me? His banes. No. No, his binds. No. Maybe that's why they've been so angry at me. I've been calling them the wrong name. Well, I'm sorry if that's the case. 
Oh, this is terrible. They're shooting at me through walls. I have no idea where they are. They're just generally in front of me. Well, let's go backwards and hope that they're not here too. Uh, there's probably one here. I'm hearing something. Oh, this is terrifying. And the thing, because of shooting through walls, like I have no idea if they're going to be able to hit me through a wall or if, yo, just let me out, please. Oh my goodness. Is this for real? Is this, is this, am I staring at this correctly? Like, is this exactly what I wanted? Yes, the answer is yes. This is exactly what I wanted. All right, we're gonna make another one of those. Drop all the stuff that we don't need. Pick up all the things that we desperately want. Yes. Cool. And uh, we can even rotate that down and pick up one more. Neato. I'm going to bring this resin down because once I get out of this, I'm going to need a resin to run back with. And then we still need ammonium. We never, we never found the ammonium. Always needing ammonium. Oh, nice. Hit yellow dirt. Normally you don't on the way down if you do it the way I've been doing it, but we did and that's okay. Let's see what we can do to slide around it now. Oh, bummer. Yellow bowl. There we go. Here's our, here's, here's the way down. Here's the ticket. One way down, please. Whee. Yeah, we're only like a minute behind pace. Only. Happy birthday. <laughs> yes, it's a little, it's a little not my birthday, but we'll take it. We, we take those. Where did the other cords come from? Oh, I'm, I must have not checked my terrain tool. I'll take it, why not? All right, so now we know we need to go back kind of to the south near our bases because we're at the North Pole, so literally every direction is south. That's not useful. That's why I don't like the North Pole. Uh, you don't have a clear compass direction. Thankfully, we've got the package item to run in the right direction. Alrighty, we have all these things here, so we can like take two of them. And that's it, that's all we can carry. We're kind of full, and we'll... Uh, this was not efficient. Nice. And then we have a need for some ammonium. So if we find it, we are dropping our generators that we just filled with organic to fill. I didn't see any ammonium, and that's a bummer. And then we will need to make our oxygen filter here, like, pronto. What are we dropping for that? No, no oxygen. We're dropping this. We're just, we're just, we're just, we don't need those generators. Alrighty, so, can we make it back to base the long way around the mountain to the left without, uh, without dying and possibly finding ammonium? I don't know. That's cool. Can I carry it? Not really. We can drop the other generator, though. Who needs generators, right? Am I right? Flat. Oh, we can pick up one of these resin, though. It won't look like we can pick up this resin, but then we can. Why? Because our backpack printer doesn't count as a real text slot until it does. We've been here before. Alright, we have one graphite in base, so we can count that one already, and we need to figure out how much we have left. The insurance policy resin. You got it. Okay. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. So we need only one more, and we have a deposit not too far away. We have this. Needs to be smelted pretty soon. We still need that silly. Yo, remember that time when the smelter, like, took your resources? 
been getting better. I shouldn't really rail it in the ground. Let's pick up two zinc. Yo, I hear we need zinc to complete this game. Real pro players bring zinc to the solo. Okay. Uh, remember that time the smelter worked? Okay. Now we need at least two aluminum, and now we need to find two ammonium somehow. Don't know how, but we'll figure it out eventually. This can get Cramalam jammed into here. And we could try and bring our small printer uh, with us, and a small generator with us. And what this will do Fala. is give us the ability to... Captain Space I hear that, Fala. Toaster. What will he get into next? What we're doing here is giving us the ability to print um, oxygen filters, sorry, uh, words, um, print shuttle thrusters portably. So when we find our uh, resin or our, our ammonium deposit, however long it takes us, we can take off from there instead of, you know, being stuck somewhere else. We also don't have a platform yet, but we do have the printer with us, so we can fix the missing printer situation. We got one, so let's set up. Set up shop. Okay, we want um, one of those, surprisingly. Forgot to print one of those. It won't hurt to make one now. And uh, let's see, it's Kamikaze232. Thank you so much for the follow. Please consider yourself cordially and officially welcome to join the Intergalactic Appliance Alliance. Should you choose to accept your invitation, you must name your favorite kitchen appliance in a kitchen near you. Of course you don't have to. And we'll have to remember this ammonium deposit for later. There's a lot of ammonium here, and that's fantastic. Okay, so we have our two zinc, we have our medium platform, we have even some random other things. Don't know what we'll do with these, but nice. Okay, we'll take this. I, I guess we'll take our printer back. It is technically a compound, so already on our way to the solo. We're like 45 seconds behind. World record pace, but we'll take it. Kamikaze shouts toaster! Well. That is indeed a mighty fine, fantastic um, kitchen appliance. And I have to say it is indeed one of my favorites, but it is not my most favorite. Even though I've named myself after toasters, they are indeed like they have a special place in my heart. I think when somebody said the panini press, <laughs> Obi-Wan Pez <laughs> comes in with the reminder. Yo, did you remember to bring zinc in the answer, Obi-Wan? Is absolutely yes. Alrighty, so I can't land on the one that I want to, so we're going to settle for less. And, uh, when you get a chance, check out Discord. Uh oh I am not going to be able to do that for at least an hour and a half. Is it, If it's more pressing, uh, a member of my Discord who has the permissions to join voice chat can tell me. Otherwise, uh, know that I will get there eventually, and I mean anyone no ill. It's Orb? It's orb. Hold on, where's orb? 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 Somebody see orb? I see no orb. Why did you say orb? There's no orb. You can't do that to me. We're on world record pace. If you if you tip if you distract me with 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 false orb sightings, I'm gonna lose it. Unless unless it was there. Orb and chat. Orb and chat. Did or, orb and chat? Where's orb? Unless somebody has orb in Discord. Is that what you're telling me? There's an orb in Discord. Well, if that's the situation, like, oh, of course, you can interrupt me for that. That's that's important. Okay, so we're here. We have this thing right there. This thing goes on top of it. And this goes right there for now. Now we need to fill up this thing with a bunch of compound and small generators. So we have like one. And I'm going to just turn on that one um, because we need more, so we'll use it, we'll burn it out. We, we needed to burn it out and then we didn't have enough. Kawhi's message in Discord is about an orb. Yeah, I, I figured, I figured there was, there was orbs going on. Well, thanks so much for sharing the memes and sharing the orbs. We need more orbs in our lives. I loved how that almost went in, but not really. Okay, so we need eight of these and we have a couple. We're getting there. We need like one more bit of compound here and we'll get it. Okay. 
One, two, three, four. This is number five. So we still need a couple more. Where are we going to find more compound? I don't know. But let's empty our inventory. Okay. Alrighty. We need four more organic, three more organic, and three more compound. Maybe four if we really want to go go ham, but I don't think we'll need that much. We're going to take a little bit of that resin for breathing purposes. Insurance resin, as it's sometimes called. And here we go. This will be enough that I think will get us in. It's the PAX receipt provided by Buenos, and it has an orb on it? Ooh. Ooh. I'll wait for this. Alrighty, and we're gonna do the thing where we swap out an inventory space on our inventory so that we like don't drop the uh, generator on the ground as it sometimes does. And we have one more, so I guess we'll print one more, even though we don't really need it, but. Going down, we have a little bit of oxygen with us. Let's do this thing. Whee! We almost got it. <laughs> we bumped into a wall. Alrighty, here's first level caverns. Let's see if we can find a Wolframite in record time. We would save a minute if we find Wolframite really fast, by the way. Like, we spend so much time, like, idling around looking for Wolframite in these saves. Uh, that's quartz. I mean, while we're down here, we can pick up bites, but that's not why we're down here. Bites are nice, and you get a good bite rate while we're here. But uh, what we really need is Wolframite, and it's this wonderful yellow mineral. We need one of them. Hoorah. Hooray. Alright, we're gonna pick up these and then continue heading down. Hopefully we run into very few dagger roots and absolutely zero his spines. Okay. Oh well we ran into one his spine. So let's just run the literal opposite direction. I was getting stuck. I don't like where I was. I don't like the, how close the hispine was. Uh, there's just a lot of a lot of bad things going on right there. So we're gonna gonna just run away from it. That looked like a rocket stuck in the ground. I saw no rocket, but I believe you. I believe that I didn't see what you saw. So whatever you saw, clip it, share it for later, and just like, yo, toaster, what is this? And we can go check it out later. And I heard a hispine, so that is terrifying because it can probably shoot me. So let's just go over here, which is the opposite direction of where I'm hearing it in my headphones. And hopefully it can't reach us while we are slowly standing here in its line of sight. All right, I think we evaded it. And before like another hispine hits us right here. I heard one, don't know where. Yo, it found us. Are we safe? Will we be able to get under here in time? I don't think so. I think we're, we're on the verge of death here. Alrighty, it looks like we're okay. Looks like we're okay. Hey, look, it's that seam. So this is the seam on DeSolo. If you find it, you can like flay open the world. It's very rare, and I don't know exactly how you need to be lined up to be able to do it, but like... If you can find it, you can just race through De Solo as if it doesn't exist. We're gonna turn on our generator, just recover some backpack power while we're running around. One, two, that's a De Solo. And we are ahead of the world record by a little bit. We have, um, we have ammonium located as well. So, so, if we do everything efficiently and we don't make too many mistakes, we have a solid shot at some world record pace going on. Unfortunately, we have some more work to do. We have to go all the way to Glacio now. And when we're at Glacio, we need to pick up... Um, 
about 19,000 bytes. And in order to do that, we'll just be grinding samples there. So that'll take some time. And uh, there's not a whole lot we can really do about it. Glacio, 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 Glacio. Yo, where is Glacio? <laughs> No glyphs was more than a minute old. Okay, well then we'll have to go in the VOD and find it again. No worries. And uh, second point, we wasted, in the world record, we wasted like a minute orbiting Glacio trying to find a landing location. So as long as we can find anything that lets us land, we're already saving time. We're already saving like big minutes. Look at all these minutes. Alrighty, let's get out of this here shuttle. And now we need to just go into the ground. I can see the shuttle, but I cannot move my camera up enough until I'm sitting on the ground. That is obnoxious. Okay, we are here. Let's get some of this titanium. Can't mine all of it, but we can mine some of it. Okay, we got two of it. We need a total of like four or something. All right, this can go on the bottom of the shuttle. Hopefully we don't lose it. That can go up there. I need, okay, okay. We're doing okay, we're doing okay. So, uh, oh, the samples are gray today. That's not a good sign. Samples that are gray are usually hard to see. If nothing else, they're like, it's totally fine that the samples are great. They just take forever to like literally find. I, I have a hard time seeing them. They aren't like more rare or anything. I just like glaze over them as I'm like fatigued, can't see things well. This is the part of the run where I have incredibly bad posture as I like into the camera, into, into the screen, trying to like glue my face into everything, seeing if I can find it. Uh, and let's see if we can maintain a somewhat consistent compass direction. That way we generally explore new terrain as we head in the same cardinal direction, avoiding retracing our steps and accidentally covering areas we've already been to before. I want this. Can I pick it up? No, there's a boomaloon in the way. Please go away, boomaloon. Thank you. Boomaloons have a large hitbox that surrounds them, an invisible sphere of sorts. And if you're inside of it, they will remove your ability to click on stuff because that's apparently what boomaloons do. It's sort of like if you had the force, there is a monster in the Star Wars Extended Universe, a little like worm that prevents you from using your force powers when you're near it. Boobaloons act just like that. Was that like a terrible reference? Did anybody catch that? Has anybody even read books from the Star Wars Extended Universe? I've read a couple and they were pretty wild, but I remember them being just kind of fluff pieces, nothing like super exciting, but they were just fun, fun reads, fun things to do. You know, mom wanted me to read. I wanted to read something. This was a fun thing to read. So now we only need one, two more titanium. Why not just be right back? Alrighty, well. Enjoy whatever it is you need to do, unless it's not enjoyable, in which case I hope it is expedient and easy to get done. Okay, um, we're gonna go run over here because I see more titanium. And there was a boom balloon in the ground. Did you see it just explode? Alrighty, let's see if we can ignore the pop coral here. There it is. We have all six titanium, so now we just need to work on the rest of the bites. And uh, what direction are we running? A eh? southeast now. Well, you know what? We can run southeast as long as we're not running northwest, right? We're not going exactly backwards. I'm okay with that. Southeast is a great direction to run. So is southwest. It's south in general, but we want to kind of go southeast or southwest, but never, never, never north. Southeast it is. Yo, look at all these bites. We like seeing these. Your game. Yes, bites. Thank you. Do -do. More bites. Good bites today. Hopefully this keeps up. So we are at 7,000. We are just a little under halfway. We are a little over a third of the way. We like. There's a large hispane here. I cannot tell you what it is, but it... Um, is one of the variants of Hispane. There are three variants of Hispane, and there are... They're all terrifying, because they all seem to be able to kill you in one hit. So... I think they're just larger. I think, I think that, like, the reason that they're more dangerous is because the clouds they make are just, like, unnecessarily larger. 
So it's easier to avoid avoid a smaller cloud. It's harder to avoid a taller cloud. I want to go this way. I see more bites this way. What, what direction are we running that way? We're running north, though, to go this way. That's spooky. So we were heading southeast. Then let's go southwest once we're here to avoid going or retracing too much of our steps here. We are in new territory. I can assure you of that. But I can assure you how long this will be new territory. Okay, so I don't want to go any more to my left here if I can avoid it. I want to continue making some progress to the right-ish based on compass direction and heading. And once I can steal away the right and find bites, they're all oh, this boom balloon is... Get out of here. Get out of here. Please. Thanks. There we go. Whoa, what's up with the, that one? That one's like stuck inside a stalagmite pretty well. Here we go. Now we can steal away to whatever this direction is. Like southeast or southwest or something. Yeah, we're going back southeast again. All right, already. That was okay. How are we doing on bites? Boomaloon. Oh, the boomaloon interrupts me uh, carrying the shuttle too. Because, you know, it's like anything your cursor is doing. Alrighty, 11,000. We are now over the halfway point. It's a good time. Good time. No bites here, though. Okay, I see a couple more bites here in the, the front areas. Gotta, gotta deal with, gotta contend with some boomaloons, though, and their obnoxious hitbox. But we can get around the hitbox and then pick up the bites. We don't have to explode that one, but we can't go through the hitbox to pick up the bites. We just have to walk around it. Don't know how I turned that on. I must have had an organic in my inventory that it stole. I bet you I picked up a mushroom. A number of mushrooms in the lower levels of Glacia will eventually give you an organic. Very handy if you need it, but I didn't necessarily know I was going for it. Must have accidentally picked it up when I was going for the titanium. Alrighty, what's in this large cavern? Anything over here? This is now kind of southeastern area still. Glad I checked the compass. I thought I was heading um, southeast originally, but no, I was heading more like northeast. So now pivoted a little bit, still going southeast. All right, I like this. Ooh, samples. I like to see these. Oh, they're green now. What? They literally just changed. Did anybody see that? One of them was gray, one of the next one is green. Hmm. Still don't know. To what extent um, samples change color? It's not like, I, you know, it, it, honestly, the thing that makes the most sense is if, like, you start a brand new world, samples change color as the world ages. You know, like, sometimes they're gray, sometimes they're green. I love it when they're green. They pop out pretty well. Um, and everything that's good is green. Or everything that's worth noticing on Glacio is green. Hispines are green. Titanium is green. Samples are green. It's a good day. And if things are green, you can know to run towards them or to avoid them if they're um, making terrible noises at you. But in in terms of like when they change color, I can't explain it. The color seems to be random and then it changes based on how old the world is or something. Maybe how long you've been on Glacio. I can't quite place it. Okay, we want to go southeast, so we are going to do just that. Okay, what we have up here? I always enjoy going south. I always felt like I was going downhill. For those of you who appreciate going downhill. Oh, this one's being protected by a boomaloon. Please go away, boomaloon. I desire what you are keeping guard. Thank you. Orb. Okay, we, we found the orb. We must do what we must. This is important. If you don't do this, the run's not blessed. Alrighty. Normally, I would try to carry the orb, but um, unfortunately, there is no way to like bring the orb back um, without like throwing the run in the garbage. I would just simply not be able to carry the resources I need instead. Um, there's no way to package them either, so you know how it works. Southeast, it's going to be a little bit to my right, but south, nor northeast is a little bit up to my left here. 
And I'm seeing bites here, so we know it's a new area, but I'm a little spooked going too much to my north here. So we're going to continue going southeast if we can. I didn't want to pull that out. We'll set that back. And there might be more bites on this thing. I'm not seeing them. Alrighty, we are very, very close. Just like one or two more samples. Honestly, we should probably research everything and then figure out if we need more samples. So we'll run and pick up like one more sample. Oh, oh here it is, here it is, here it is. Whoop, oh, whoop. Oh. Is there a his spine around or a, boo or a boom balloon around? I don't know. Maybe just hacky. Regular hacky collision. The large shuttle, please. The large storage. That thing. All of these bits. And then uh, the silo. The boost. The boost mod. Drill mod three. The packager. The packager. I need one more sample. Wow. Glad I didn't research something useless. Samples. Where is one sample? Here are some samples. We will run over here and collect all three of these. Alrighty, so these bites felt good today. Um, didn't lose a whole lot of time picking up bites today, and that's always a good thing. So to get out of here... Oh, we're dancing. Oh, okay. It's fine. Um, put, put, it, put the orb in the shuttle's cockpit. Yes, yeah, so where we're going, we don't need to fly the shuttle anymore. We'll let the orb steer the way. Um, we're going to shove our shuttle inside this wall here, and then we're going to get out of the shuttle and then try and pick up the foot. Nice. Now we're going to pop out of the ground, and now we need to find one iron. So I don't have a great strategy for finding iron other than just, like, pick it up off the ground, but this wreckage might have some good stuff, so I'm going to go take a quick look at it. It's going to have, like, a some scrap some organic some compound yeah that's that's not good stuff and then this that's cool but we don't need it so all right now we just got to go find iron literally anywhere this ammonium is cool so we're going to take some of this ammonium as well yo what's up with my inventory how come i can't move this around that was wild so because we had the oh i bet you the printer interferes with your backpack you probably can't do what you want with it or something any iron around here more ammonium wow we have so much ammonium here we have iron over here i want to be able to pick up more of this ammonium but i don't want to drop anything for it that it's really precious to me i mean like sure we'll drop a generator but like <sighs> just, i can't do it i can't drop all my generators i need them too we have ammonium in the world that's the thing so if we didn't i would i would be more inclined to um take it now but because we have ammonium we just have to go like working for it i'm going to be able to be okay so we're picking up a little bit yo i thought we had more iron here do we not we need one more like little hint of iron okay there it is what can we drop for it we'll drop an ammonium as much as we hate to do that Alrighty. Yo, we have we have three minutes ahead. That's so good. Three minutes ahead of world record pace. Actually having ammonium in a run. What is this? We remembered to bring zinc to DeSolo. Like what on earth? <laughs> Alrighty. Where is Silva? There it is. And we're even close to our base. Please let me land here in time before it rotates. No! We have to orbit all of Silva. Ah. Uh, bummer. We were close. We were close. I bet you if we were like 20 seconds earlier, we might have been able to get there in time. Now would be a great time to remind you that, uh, honestly, I don't know how to refer to them. Um, 
there's a user in Discord who named themselves like AP Astrodeer Exam October 6th, which it's October 6th today. Um, this user is named Adolescent in Discord, but they named themselves Atonfire in other locations online. Um, Atonfire has made a AP Astrodeer Exam. If you're a fan of taking AP tests in your free time, you know, like you may be. Um, more specifically, if you want to take like a fun constructed Astrodeer, is this my... No, that's not it. If you want to take a fun uh, test that's like all Astroneer themed questions, um, this is this is totally up your alley. It, it was really well made. Um, and uh, anybody who participates is in for a treat. It's like some of the questions are going to be difficult. You're going to need to know your stuff. I hope I clicked on my base. I clicked on like a beacon that looked like it was my base. I'm a little concerned that it wasn't. OK, there we go what happens when you have a base so close to the North Pole. Does anybody remember where my ammonium was? I think it was over here. Well, let's ignore that for now. Ignore the piles of resources that we still need to do stuff with. Okay, we need to save these. And start smelting. Sure, we'll smelt that. We really need the tungsten online first. And then the iron can go next. We did save this, so we get to keep this still, which is a nice thing. We have a second triptych. We need this, we need that, and then we need the tungsten smelted. So, let's go ahead and turn on our generators. Okay. Now that that's smelting, we can throw on another titanium and another iron and another titanium. Sure, why not? Okay, we have so much to do. Let's get medium silos up and running. We're going to want to start running this around our base, so we're going to rip the shuttle off of it so we have it for later. Hopefully we don't forget it. There's our tungsten. Chem lab. So that's printing. We need a plastic, which is a carbon and a organic we have that we need one more of these so let's go make this thing is that it do we not have another oh i thought we had more graphite here oh that's 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 unfortunate we're gonna have to go find another graphite from somewhere literally anywhere i thought we had enough but we do not got the iron i need at least one carbon next so Okay, I need this other quartz. You can almost set that up next. Okay, we have the second titanium. We can make whatever this is. A silo. Carry a bunch of stuff. Right, we are out of organic. We'll put those down. And then we need a compound and a carbon, which we're almost done with the carbon, I think. I thought we were doing... Oh, did we, did we make a carbon and then it fell down? I don't think we did. Okay, there we go. Now we're doing carbon. All right, so one, two. We should have some more ammonium hiding around here somewhere. But I'm not seeing it. Oh, we, we don't. That was another safe zone. So we need 21 ammonium still. So we need 23 total. No, we need 20 ammonium total. Well, wait, nope, we need 21 still. Because that's how it works. Still have some organic over here that we can turn on. Plastic, please. We have two fuel thrusters. We have one more aluminum for our third fuel thruster, and then we should have an aluminum hiding around here for like a soil centrifuge should we choose to build one, but I'm literally not seeing it, so I don't know where it went. That's a little unfortunate. We have lost an aluminum somewhere. Because that one's for a thruster, like I can't lose it. We can make this boost mod of all things. We have a wide mod here, so we get to use both of those things, which is kind of cool. Okay, so now with the iron, and the plastic and all that stuff, we can work on the atmospheric condenser. And I kind of want to make, um, a lot, but I kind of want to make 
more platforms, but I don't think I'll have the organic, so we'll just do this. Hopefully we can find stuff. Yeah, we're going to be using a lot of power very quickly. A lot of... Okay. Okay. More titanium, sure. Sword silo. So we have two thrusters. We still need one more ammonium for all that good stuff. We can make another, like, compound. So yeah, we can't make... We can't make our, um... so sad we can't make our soil centrifuge we didn't didn't print enough we didn't get enough aluminum or we lost an aluminum along the way in the meantime maybe we'll find that graphite we're missing where was the graphite the graphite was right here in this channel any more graphite hiding around here nope okay Okay, we're gonna get this large medium platform B, large platform B started. Uh, in the meantime, we can start making gas, hydrogen, please. I think that's too much power, so we'll turn off one of them. Okay. Burn some more of this. This will this will slow down our base too much, so we're gonna turn it off though and just kind of prep getting this going. Okay. Um we should consider running out and getting more. Me me speed run with you. No, not right now. Fortunately, this is a solo category, so because of that, we are unable to run it as partners. If we were, that would change the category, but we're already too far into this one to make that a reality, and it's quite honestly a bit of a chore to go um, teach somebody the co-op any percent route. It's fun, like we could, but um, probably not going to go start that up quite yet. We can go do that some other time. If you are interested in running how, if you're interested in running like solo, sorry, co-op any percent it's, there's, there's, there's a lot of fun to do that in the run like you can do a lot of cool stuff um it's just a bit more involved than just like getting into playing astroneer with your friends because you have to memorize a lot of stuff basically okay so that's running finally cabin lab is back up and running as well that's cool Alrighty. so with that in mind let's turn this on and we will start running picking up all of the 21 ammonium that we still need, and we hopefully will find it just over here. Now we have the wide mod and the boost mod, which is quite honestly a huge blessing. We normally don't ever get the wide mod ever. Um, we just happen to be to run into it basically. So that should speed things up as long as we have power to keep up the, the mods basically. And this is where the ammonium is, we know, because we dropped this off nearby. Now we're just going to pick up ammonium. Oh my goodness, this is so fantastic. Clear chat. Clear chat. Clear chat. Clear chat. I get it. I see what's going on. Thanks. Thanks, Obi-Wan. I do appreciate it. I do have like an automod somewhat, but it's I kept on like letting it all say all the things and now I didn't <laughs> now it's just at a point where it barely does anything, but I should probably figure out like how to go through all that system again. So we have nine ammonium so far. Okay, how we doing now? So we have nine plus six, that is 15 total ammonium. And there's another ammonium deposit just over the hill. I don't know if it's as large, but we'll see. Yes, the answer is yes. <laughs> the, the answer is an absolute yes, so. 
These things hold 24, so if we need 21, uh, we need only three spaces empty. Alrighty. Wow, that was awesome. Getting all of our ammonium that fast? I do not know what to say. This run will be very difficult to beat, that's for sure. If we don't make any mistakes. <laughs> dot, 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 dot. Pick up some compound while we're here, because why not? Okay. We have some downtime, not much. Oh, we also need to find that graphite. Have no idea how we're going to do that. And I don't have a soil centrifuge yet, because I don't have the things you need to make one. Here's our pit. Okay. Solid fuel thruster. We almost have ten, uh, ten, uh, whatchamacallits. Okay. Hydrogen. So there's. Yo, that was a little. That was a little questionable. So we need two more single bits of hydrogen. That we can start making. So this one goes over here. And we can start actually putting this over here. We need to start grinding out hydrazine. A bunch of it. Like ten of it. Okay, so this is good to go. Now we need to stop this. Make two nitrogen. And now we are basically good to start um, a lot of things. We did need to make a chair at some point. Let's go make a chair. Chair, 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 chair. Okay, one hydrogen, one hydrazine. Start putting generators on this thing. So we're good here, we can turn this off. We don't need to burn power into that. Okay, we have so much to continue building there. It's okay, we're slow to get in there. out and collect a bunch more organic here in a quick moment but we're just slowly like I'm gonna save two compound because I might want to build my soil centrifuge okay Should know colors by now, but you do not. Colors, colors of gas. Oh, you're probably looking looking at the color of gas, wondering what it is or something. All right, we are running a little low on power. That's kind of, it's not surprising in any way. We're gonna slowly fill up our backpacks inventory. This isn't plugged in, so we can plug it in. I'm just like set it on top for now. Okay. And we have two extra compound left over, so we need to continue finding good stuff. Okay. Let's go pick up more organic. Um, see if we can find graphite anywhere, I guess. More compound would be nice, too. I know there's a little bit of compound in that direction, but that's probably pretty far out. I wonder how I'm going to get graphite. That's going to be the toughest one right now. 
Oh, we want pets. Out of curiosity, do you happen to have a little bit of a color deficiency? That's a little bit of a personal question, so you don't have to answer it if you don't want to. Because I consider the um, high nitrogen to be purple. And I do know that they are close. So maybe there's something going on there. But maybe not. Maybe maybe it's just like a little bit of a different approximation of color. Okay, we need two more resin as well. We have one. Okay, while we are on the resin train, let's go ahead and find more medium platform A's. And I do believe we are short in ammonium somehow. That's spooky. One, two, three, four, five, six. What's on? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No, we have. What is this ammonium for? We must have just made an extra ammonium, I suppose. Uh, graphene. Oh, I went the wrong direction for graphene. Okay, so we have all of that over here. We will start off. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We just made ten. I need to find another graphite somehow. Which we can do remotely of all things. Slowly fill up our backpack while we're waiting. Uh, this can start going on the back side, I suppose. Okay. Need two of these. I thought, I thought something happened. My, continue mining out this area might reveal another graphite. The answer is no. Hydrazine is magenta. I consider hydrazine lavender. Magenta makes sense to me. Where'd the nitrogen go? This is like very purple to me. Although the gas is blue. The gas is blue. You got me there. The gas itself, very blue. The color on top, per very, very purple. Very, ma very magenta on top to me. Very, very, very purple. Yo, I thought I hit that one. Okay, here we go. The triptychs are magenta. Yeah. Alrighty. Um, so we're getting... Oh, we've never got clay. Oh, goodness gracious. Alrighty, let's go find an aluminum. Is there aluminum here? No, that was another save. Okay. Is there aluminum here? No, okay. Well, we need more aluminum, so I'm going to go down and get aluminum. I can make my two titanium di uh, alloy at least. Titanium alloy, we need two of these. They're working super slowly though, because we have no power anymore. It's okay. Okay, let's go down. Find some aluminum somewhere. There it is. There's the aluminum. We just passed it. Okay, now we can get our soil centrifuge online. <laughs> the soil centrifuge will be useful in getting clay that we completely forgot about. Um, didn't want to open that game. Please don't open my UI just by clicking on my character. I understand it's a diegetic UI, but I cannot stand that. Okay, okay. Got one. We're out of power. Literally, we have no power in the base whatsoever. So we need to go find a whole bunch of more organic. Let's go do that. Yeah, we are like dropping frames left and right. That's a little wild. Wonder why. Mm 
Soil centrifuge, please. Okay, I got these two things cooking. I can make two diamonds now. Two diamonds or three diamonds? We need to make three diamonds now. The large shuttle is almost ready to go. And I can't disconnect it and move it, so that's fine. One, two. Make a drill mod with this. Cat is now talking about colors. Third diamond. Okay. I think we're basically done with this. Let's go see if we can move all the stuff over to it. Yeah, I didn't want you to go there. Okay, we're gonna fill it up so we can get to five. Clay. Okay, and then we can go fill this up again. Okay. Put it full. Wait, one more on. Okay. We still need more resin too, yikes. We also need a single graphite. We'll do that now. I guess this can be my resin when I get a chance. Where'd the canister go? Where did the canister go? Is, that a, is it in my inventory? Canister is just gone. It's down here. Okay. I need six resin at least, so we'll just make the full round of resin. Okay. Large shuttle, sure, why not? Once this is done, we can start the large storage that we should have started a while ago. Still a little short on power, that's fine. Okay. Need more res court. We need more. <laughs> need a lot of everything. We're gonna go pick up more organic and fill up our canister while we're at it. And make more, or more resin. Make more, more organic, I guess. Well, we can we can mine organic by hand. What we what we should do is we should make more compound, so we can get our um get all of our like extra thrusters on the way. Okay. Compound, please. Okay, this is... We're on our way. 
We have one thruster, two thruster, three thruster, and a chair. The atmosphere condenser is almost done. So we need two more of these, which we have two more in our inventory. Awesome. We're getting there. We are getting there. We are almost on our way. Let's go ahead, pick this up, slap it on. Ah, we can leave that there, I guess. generator okay seem to slowly fill this thing up with generators then we'll have all the generators we need for the run compound do we need like four okay, so one one more round of the soil centrifuge will get us there we're running out of organic though the even close organic that's nearby is just not present so well, I heard a thud that must be my downstairs neighbor okay uh, any organic will do. We just need to get our rocket finished, and then we can fill up all of these things from the nearby forest, and then we can, like, head out. After we check our inventory, of course. We don't want to leave without, like, the, the, the hydrogen and stuff. Okay. Should be enough organic in those. Alrighty, we are getting ready to go. Wow, I am very happy with how far we are. So this can go over here. What is this missing? We're missing some stuff on here. The triptychs. And there's one more thing that's usually here, but I think it's fine. We'll bring that. Okay, this can go in the auxiliary slot. Okay, move this over to filters. Okay, this can go, sure, this can go, sure. Bring this to, doesn't hurt to have. This can go up above. And that's everything in this. You know, sometimes we have a wind turbine. We don't have one today. Alrighty, we are good to go. And now we just need to fill up all of our... Uh, need to go fill up every single generator as fast as we can. Probably shouldn't have dropped the wide mod, but I did, so it's fine. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. 
Okay, three more. No, six more. Well, nine more. Ah, counting. There's a six of them in the auxiliary slot that, that are missing everything still. Okay, four-ish more. We want a little more for our own person, but that's okay. Okay. We had some time loss in there because we like forgot to print stuff and we really delayed on our soil centrifuge and I kept on like not wanting to print it and then I really did need it. Um, so there was clearly some moments there where we could have done better, but I'm okay with how we're doing. So now the name of the game is can we land on all the planets in okay time without losing too much time? I think the answer is yes, but that'll be the hard part. So now we need to figure out if we can land next to this thing. And we really can't. Um, this one's... Both of these are... Uh, okay, let's do this one and go to the North Pole. This one's considerable, but... I don't, wasn't... wasn't I wasn't buying it. We've got a ways to go, kind of, regardless of how we do it. Now we just gotta hope we don't explode. While we are doing this, we can collect two methane. They attacked us to our right. Sorry, our left. Part of my brain that knows directions is just a little backwards sometimes. Hey, Tactus, how's it going? Don't mind me. Just casually not dying on an Aatrox. You know, the usual. You have a good day, okay? There's one methane. We need two methane, then two sulfur. Okay, so I heard the second methane, so let's go ahead and stop that. Alpha, please. Okay. These are up and ready to go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Four. Okay, it's going down. Awesome. these useful there's a battery on this thing which is cool okay, there's one sulfur then I want to save a couple of these Okay, and then we'll charge up the battery, and then we'll start heading down. Okay, got the sulfur ready to go. Uh, silicone. I, I move the recipe over first, because otherwise it just rearranges the shuttle's um, stuff too much. Okay, yeah, all the... All the, uh, 
things are starting to run out. It's fun. Okay. There's two. Explosive pattern number one. Why don't I hold the battery? The battery sounds like a nice thing to have in my inventory. Okay, we have both explosive powder running now, so we can now. Alrighty, we are good to go. Wish me luck, because Aatrox is the most deadliest of all the planets. We have two hydrogen on us, the hydrogen explodes. That's all you need to know. So you need to go fast, but not too fast, and not too slow. And also, you might randomly explode and die, you know? Haha, -ha, very fun. Like right there, how you see how we got like stopped? If there was an attack disc right there, there's not much we can do about it. Just have to like not run into stalagmites. Also his spines, but those are less less concerning because you can usually just kind of freak out and avoid them. Uh, it's the attack disses that you can freak out and then not avoid because they explode. And they're fun. Also, my light was about to give out here. Uh, your light is a nice thing to have, but it unfortunately isn't a guarantee if you don't have one. So the battery helps. Why do we have a, why do we have our light still? Oh, because we have only used the battery. We haven't used, we haven't used the backpack yet. Wait, what? Why aren't we using power? Why is our backpack still at full? We have two mods running. Do we have two mods running? We should have two mods running. Why do we have... I am very confused right now. Yo, is this is this small battery just broken? So we absolutely didn't go through all of our backpack's power. Something must have changed recently. Also, we did we did Aatrox super well. I'm super happy with how that Aatrox went. Yeah, we even we even saved a whole minute there. That's that's just crazy. That's nuts. We're on a solid record pace right now. I'm hoping we can keep this up. Okay. Two explosive powder. Um. Um. Okay, so we apparently don't have the second explosive powder ready quite yet. Because reasons. We only have one. But that's fine. We just need to go. That too close. Ah, we need the shuttle on the bottom of the sh okay. Four seconds of time loss. Why can't I fly again? Alright. Also, apparently we messed up the explosive powder. But it's done now, so. To Kalidor. The dusty red planet. That's not Mars, but totally, totally kind of like. I mean, like, if it was like Mars, I mean, like, it's definitely kind of. I mean, don't, like. Don't don't say it. It's definitely not Mars, TM. But, like, if, if it was kind of like Mars, you might see it. You know what I mean? Like. Um, okay, actually, let's, is real talk though, I can't wait until we get, like, a spirit and opportunity event where we have to find both rovers on Mars as they, like, roam around and stuff. That'd be super fun. Alrighty, need some organic over here, some over here, awesome. So we can turn this off, take it, take this. Well, we don't need those quite yet, so let's empty our inventory just a little bit so that we can fill up on organic and other good stuff. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we need to go fast. Whoa, look at all this organic though. 
This is fantastic. I might just fill up on organic while I'm here. Because we have so much of it. And we're pretty well set up to collect it, you know? So we need 12 of these on Kalidor. We have a solar panel now, which is kind of fun. Okay, we're going down. Make an oxygen filter. We can slap this on the base. We have enough stuff. We're ready to go. All right, we'll take this shallower angle for now. Is my generator on? There it is. Hispane! Hispine! Hispine! I know, I know, I know it's a Hispine, I'm sorry. Malachite, eh? There's a Astroneer's... Um... Hmm. Backpack that we just passed. It had, it had an oxygen filter on it, but I didn't want to lose time picking it up. Stalagmite. Digging too steep of an angle, our astroneer can't slide on it. See, now our backpack ran out of power. That was weird. I have no idea why that didn't happen on Aatrox. That should have happened on Aatrox for what it's worth. We like apparently weren't using power, but yet we still had all of our mods active. I wonder how we can repeat that. That was, like, that's a super useful bug if we can, like, reuse that bug a little bit more. Here's hoping we actually remember to pick up the, um, explosive powder. Okay, we did. Now we can recharge the battery. Oh, missed. Yeah, there we go. Alrighty. There we go. Okay. Alright. I'm excited. Could lower this world record by another like five minutes today if we do it right, but that's gonna be tough. We had some good spawns and we could land near gateways on all the other planets, so I'm hoping we can keep it up, but you know, you know how it works. When we're going to Vasanya, we need we already have all the organic we need for Vasanya. So, probably just good to, like, land and run straight to the gateway and not pick up any organic. We'll need a little bit of organic and resin. So we'll pick up some for convenience for our inventory, but there's nothing that's saying we absolutely need to right now, because we already have so much in our shuttle. So where's the gateway? Wow, I know there's a gateway at the North Pole. I think there's one right here. Oh, no, there's one here. So there's one right here. It's just we're not seeing it for some reason. So we'll go over here to the North Pole and then walk to this one. Grabbed the cut for the triptych. No, I'm still at the right triptych. Because we just flew to Vasanya, and now we are on Vasanya. We are about to do Vasanya's triptych. Oh hey, that's a that's a hostile plant.
Okay, we're losing a little bit of time here having to run all the way to the gateway, but this isn't the end of the world. Followed. I saw some res over here and I don't see it anymore. I don't know where it went. Toaster. Mimi Bloops, thank what you so much for that next? follow. Please consider yourself cordially and officially welcome to join the Intergalactic Appliance Alliance. Should you choose to accept your invitation, you must name your favorite kitchen appliance in a kitchen near you. Okay, we have thing. Op open the thing, please. Thanks. Okay, hold on. We don't have all of the organic we need. We need like four more. We need two more. This will be fine. One. Okay, there's enough for the gateway. Oh, we should like plug in the thing. Okay, so now I need to create one of these, get a little more resin, and then we'll be good. Awesome. Let's go. Oh, we need graphene. No, we don't. We, what do we need? We, we need graphene, not silica. Graphene it is. My inventory is full. Fixed. Minor time loss. Camera. Tunnels, please. Oh, you thought, you thought I was at Novus? Nope, we are on to Sonya. Novus will be next. Novus needs the silicone. Did anybody need a lithium? <laughs> Got some extra for you. One stutter, that's fine though. We're technically like really close to not being able to die here, but we're gonna slide down anyway. That jump was probably unnecessary, but we'll take it. The second one of those might kill us actually, so let's not. We slap into the ground too much, we will probably die. We're going pretty fast. Okay, there we go. That was pretty that was pretty good. And I have no idea which one I need. Oh, this one. Ooh. Little bit of time loss, nothing crazy. We have some triptychs in our inventory we need to get rid of. And now we need to pick up a bunch of organic. 21 organic, I believe is the number. So all of them but three. So in order to do that, we're going to, uh, well, of course, pick up all these. Oh, yep. Slap it back on the shuttle, wherever it goes. It goes on the shuttle somewhere. Oh, right, there's an organic where we normally put that. Nice. Now our inventory is almost empty, ready to go. We'll put these two things there, and now we're just going to run around and collect organic like crazy. Go ham. Yo, got a graphite. Nice. I didn't want to collect that, but I did. Need 
some more of this resin if we can. Also, we're like walking in between lash leaves, so let's see if we can knock those over here. Two more organic at least. Swap this out. That can go in our inventory, I guess. Goes on the bottom. Didn't want to get in, I wanted to open it. That's not where my cursor was. My cursor was clearly over the box. You can see the frame. Okay. Need two silicone. I have one resin. We don't have very much resin. Yeah, we're losing a little bit of time. It's okay. We're still on like four minutes pace. Um, which is which is fantastic. So we need to go to Novus now. And we need to kind of land as close as we can to a gateway. We need to pick up two more or, um, resin for, for breathing, for safety. One at the minimum. Like, we absolutely cannot complete the game with the current amount of resin that we have. But maybe with the second one. Okay, we get to land close to a gateway this time, so that's cool. Okay, here's some resin, that's cool. We'll pick that up maybe on the way out. Exit this. that filter now that I think about it it's Novus. Novus is too small for a filter. Yeah we got some habitite though. What is this crunchy cavern we're, we're digging here? I don't like what's going on here. Can we just not do this? Can we just... using our drill mods, which is kind of fine, but yeah, I don't know what was going on. Something something was wonky. Something wonky was going on. Like the camera itself like wasn't positioned well or something. So we lost a little bit of time there. Oh, wrong side. Bummer. I don't know how to put um, resources in this side. If I could, we'd be able to save like two seconds each time, but... that much time. That's a little surprising. So we have one extra resin. Feeling pretty good. Shuttle is over here. I can dig this. Let's not misclick as we fly to the unidentified satellite. The satellite that shall not be identified. But if it's to be identified as the unidentified satellite, isn't it the identified satellite? Hmm. 
ways to go. So here's hoping we don't accidentally throw our shuttle off the side of the platform, because that can happen. Nice. Not at the whole shuttle, but that's fine. We'll take this. Basically the next best thing. Trucks. Saved time. <laughs> Saved 11 seconds there, putting in the gateways a little more efficiently. That was kind of cool. Basically, I just put them in my inventory so that I had them. And then uh, I could, like, start slapping them down. So I made some mistakes, dropped them in, but then I knew uh, the Silva and DeSolo ones were also on the shuttle still. Although I did try to put one in for DeSolo really early, but... Should be a landing spot right around here. Right, we'll take any of them. This is way better than last run. We had to like lose another 30 seconds here. Just like, how come we can't get in? So question, do we need more resin? I don't think so. Okay, so we have this, we have a filter. So I had a pretty good Bassan, yeah? Yo, I want this. I think our best planet today was Khaled. Was was either um, Aatrox or um, Kalidor felt pretty good. I don't know what, like, what our fastest planet was though. I should look up, I should look up the stats. Can't, can't start sliding. I want to, but the, the platform I'm digging isn't steep enough. What did I just mine? I have no idea. There's a cataplant. I can't move. Game, why can't I move? Please explain to me what is wrong. Oh my goodness. Camera was stuck inside of a wall, and I couldn't, um... I couldn't figure out what was wrong. The game wouldn't let me move, and the camera wasn't showing me that there was a ceiling above my head. The fact that there was a cataplant shooting at us was absurd. Ugh. We are we are through it. We, we are out of the thick of it. So I think this means we're on our way to another world record. As long as we don't mess this up, which is possible to mess up, by the way. I've totally screwed this up before. Okay. Go to the other side. have it we're about to set a new world record pretty happy with this I'm fair to clean run we could have had a little bit better like base building section before we flew to Aatrox I think we got to save like a minute or two there and then we have some small issues where that we can fix as time goes on some small things that need to be adjusted but for the most part this is pretty airtight could have had power early on you know nice things but we made do with what we could That's Astroneer in under an hour and 55 minutes. That's nuts. That's crazy. I'm not sure 
if we can get it below an hour and 50 or not. But like, this game is so speedy now. We're, we're so fast. Cool. Fantastic. Oh, thank you, Tony Tracks. Thank you, TV Coder. Budapandi, hello. Thank you so much. <laughs> Everybody's coming in like, oh, Toaster got it again. Yeah. <laughs> Twitch numbers are wrong. Yeah, so there are there are a couple folks here watching. There aren't too many, but that's okay. That's more than okay. The fact that we have a couple people here who want to see this just means more than enough to me, and I'm 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 so excited that there are a couple folks just watching. So thank you so much for tuning in.